Kung Fu Panda movies in one minute. Kung Fu fanboy Poe tries to sneak into a ceremony celebrating the choosing of the Dragon Warrior, but bumbles his way into being chosen by the Elder Mutant Ninja Turtle. Turns out he sucks at Kung Fu and has no discipline and everyone hates him. Master Splinter, I mean Master Shifu, uses food to train Poe, which works until Poe's a Kung Fu prodigy. Good thing too, because Shifu's older student is on his way to wreck everything and steal the Dragon Scroll, which has power. It actually doesn't, but it does. Just inner strength, Poe wins. So what's more threatening than a big beefy guy? <laughs> Genocide. This peacock did it to the pandas years ago. Now the peacock wants to take over the world, so Poe tries to stop him but gets shot for his efforts. He remembers how his parents sacrificed themselves to save him during the peacock's assault. Now Poe can do this. That's pretty cool. The peacock dies, but wait, Poe's dad is still alive. So shocking. The turtle I mentioned earlier died, by the way. He's in the spirit realm fighting this guy, Kai, who sort of kills him, so he's like double dead now? It's fine, he just doesn't have key. Poe's dad shows up and gets attacked by Jade zombies. Dad's like, you gotta learn how to use key because Kai stole everyone's, but it turns out dad has no idea what he's doing. Poe decides to train himself and teaches the other pandas how to fight. Poe and Kai fight in the spirit realm while the other pandas use their key, so now Poe's OP and blows up Kai. The turtle's like, I chose you to be my success because you're a panda and cool with your ancestry and you're probably a good dancer and sends Poe back to the Earth Realm where he can continue to be a... Uh...